Hey, it's the Midnight Raven, and today I want to look at some bath bombs with you that I got from Sue Ryder. If you've seen my previous haul video, I will link it in the description or it will pop up here. And I bought a set of bath bombs which we opened in the video but didn't really look at. And I wanted to go through them because there are like seven bath bombs in here. There's a description, and we can look at them in a bit more depth than we could do in the haul video. Before we get into this video, if you'd like to consider like subscribing, that would be amazing. If you want to go over to my Instagram as well, I am the Midnight Raven. If you haven't met me before, my Instagram is the Midnight Raven. If you want to support the channel, consider giving me a super chat, or if you'd like to support the channel, link is in the description to my paper, or consider becoming a member for as little as 99 pence. Every penny that goes into my channel goes into buying more stuff to give you daily content throughout the whole of 2022. So here we have the box that I picked up. It's from a company called, I wanna say it's called Stantus. Um, I can't really read the company name, but it came in this gorgeous box. You've obviously got the woman there reading her book. And this has seven bath bombs, cleansing and moisturizing, skin softening, skin smoothing, relaxing and soothing. So obviously it was wrapped originally and I unwrapped it. Inside it shows us all the bath bombs with a little bit of a description. You've got a little noodles as I call them. Gotta love the noodles. Inside you get this little card. Obviously this came from a charity shop but it says share a video or some photos on Amazon to get another free set. Okay. Thank you for choosing Stannis. Uh, refund if skin irritation is developed. New product testing change in is free. Um, and they've got the support team. So share a video or some photos on Amazon to get another free set. Okay. Maybe I'll do that. So in this box, it looks like we've got quite a few bath bombs. So let's get into this video. So the first bath bomb we're going to look at on the list is this one. So it's just got a red heart and it is just a circular plain white bath bomb. It says that this is the love bath bomb with coconut oil. And it says create a romantic bath contains the anti-aging goodness of cocoa butter and coconut oil. Uh, Moisturise your skin and make your skin soft and supple. So that's kind of cool. This is the kind of bath bomb you could maybe use for Valentine's, maybe. So we'll put that one there. Okay. The second bath bomb is like yellow, and then you've got like these bits. I'm guessing these are going to be like flower petals or something. Another circular one. And this is the cozy. The Cozy Queen. Okay, Cozy Queen with Yulang Yulang. Okay, Yulang Yulang. This promotes relaxation, helps soothe the senses of stress and anxiety. Well, that's kind of cool. It's got Yulang Yulang and dried, I think it's dried lavender. Yeah, I want to say it's dried lavender, hence the smell. Um, the writing itself. It's a little hard to read. Um, it's not <laughs> the best, but I think it's dried lavender, hence it being like this purpley colour. But yeah, another lovely bath bomb. So that's two. So the third bath bomb looks like this. So inside you've got like this little swirl, got this peachy colour, and then you've got this blue. And this one is called Vibrant Cream with Sweet Orange Oil and Sheer Butter. Mm, that smells quite nice. So this brings an uplifting and energizing aromatherapic arom experience to your bath. Extra sheer butter for better skin moisturizing. Now, girls and men, let's say. Everybody's skin at the minute needs extra moisturising. 
How cool is that? And remember, I got these bath bombs for four pounds. And I ummed and ahed on whether to get them because I don't generally buy bath products from charity shops, if I'm honest. Um, you know, with the whole COVID thing nowadays, you have to be careful, you know, on what you get. Next, we have this one. So it's a little cupcake. Look at that. Oh, and to think you put this in your bath and not eat it. So this is the Sprinkles Cupcake. Oh, smells divine. This is lavender with sheer butter and an edible, edible candy. Okay. So this, the cream part is made of sheer butter, which is hard to dissolve, but works best for dry and itchy skin. So I have eczema, so this will probably work really, really well. But it says it's got edible candy. I wouldn't eat it personally, but that looks kind of cool. Okay, next we have this one, which is a square bath bomb. So we've got like a bath cube. So this is different. The rest of them have been round apart from the cupcake, which is still... Hmm. Oh, this one smells really nice. What's this one? So this is the Youth in Blossom. And this is... Hang on a sec. So this one is Peppermint and Galdula? I think you pronounce it. The um flower on the top. I think it's called Gaudula or something. It's hard to pronounce, but that's cute. It smells really nice. You can definitely smell the peppermint. Then we have two donuts, um, bath bombs. And they're kind of stuck together right now. Okay, so we've got two donuts. The first donut is like this purpley blue. And you've got pink. So these are these are kind of basic donuts. They don't have any sprinkles or anything. So it's a kind of a basic donut. And this is called Wildest Dreams. Okay, and this is Freesia Oil. Okay, and this is Fizzes Out with Beautiful Bubbles, an intense pinkish blue combination. Um and a downright satisfying to watch fizzing effect. Ooh. We do like a fizzing effect in our bubbles. And this is freesia oil. I've never heard of freesia oil in a donut or in a bath bomb. But it does smell nice. And then we have one last bath bomb. I cannot believe I got this for four quid. Can you believe I got this for four quid? Thank you to Sue Ryder. A charity shop that is normally very, very expensive, mind you. Next, we've got a pink one. This is just a plain pink donut. Nothing really to write home about on this one. And this is Flora's Secret. It's meant to have like a whitey, like a whitey pink tinge. It shows here like a white pink tinge, if you can just about see it. Um, and this one is Rose Oil. Now, if you're not new to my channel, you know I love rose as a scent. This is a cute donut that brings a different bath experience. Works to stimulate circulation to promote healthy glow. And I can quite happily believe that because rose oil is so soothing. It's a bit like lavender. Not as soothing, mind you. The most soothing thing is lavender or chamomile. But rose is a very close second. So that was everything we got for four pounds. What do you think? Did I get a deal or did I get a deal? So we have the Flora's Secret, which is Rose. We have this one, which is Wildest Dreams, which is Freesia Oil. We got the little square one, which is Peppermint Oil, and it's called Truth uh, Youth in Blossom. Then we got the little cupcake, which is called Sprinkle Cupcake, which is lavender and sheer butter. Gotta love a bit of lavender. Next, we got this one, 
which is called Vibrant Cream in its Sweet Orange Oil and Shea Butter. It smells really nice. Okay, then we got this one, which I've never had. I don't think I've ever had a yellow bath bomb. Um, but this is Cozy Queen. And this has um, Ylang Ylang. And it's got um, lavender um, leaves in it. It all smells really nice. And then the last bath bomb we have is the Lover. And this is the coconut oil for romantic bath time. Ooh. And that was everything I got. So I got all of them for four pounds from Sue Ryder. How lucky am I to have spotted that? Because what caught my eye was that they were bath bombs, but on the back, there are no pictures, no nothing. I didn't know what I was getting. I honestly thought there were going to be like four big bath bombs in there. Instead, there was an entire set. And I am so happy I picked these up. Um, and it basically just says, build, fill the bathtub with warm water, remove the wrapper and drop into the water. And this is what it looks like. I am so happy I picked this up. I was sceptical on whether to pick it up or not. But now I'm, I'm so glad I did. Um, but yeah, this cost me £4 from Sue Ryder. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. I load videos every day and I hope to load ev videos every day throughout 2022 as well. If you'd like to support the channel in any way, the link is in the description to the paper. Or if you'd like to consider donating to the channel, you can always donate by giving me a super chat. Or like I said, you can become a member for behind the scenes, extra videos and more content. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, I will load some pictures of these bath bombs. So that you can see them a bit better. Because my camera is not the greatest. And my laptop is still broken. It's been 18 months. I will fix it eventually. But yeah, there you go. £4 from Sue Ryder. Don't forget to go to your charity shops and support them this Christmas. Because you'll find there are so many bargains in a charity shop that you might miss. And I will see you very soon for another video. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye guys.